This is Suzanne in France, property reference number SIF001850. All the details can be found under the See More button under the main photo of this video. So looking down at the main property and then going into a very pretty front, front door. Spin round again so that you can see the length of the property. Garage on the end, house on the left hand side and at the bottom of the photo there is the sheet. So straight in now through that pretty blue door I just showed you into the dining room. A wood burner. Closed double doors out to the back where there's a gravel terrace area, seating. Stairs to the first floor and there's downstairs toilet with hand basin. So the radiators that you see are not connected. They were put in with a view to putting a wood burner with a back boiler that are not collected, connected. But you do instead have like a heat exchange unit, which you can see there under the beam. The heat exchange unit runs on electricity and there's a thermo dynamic hot water cylinder as well. So fully fitted kitchen, plenty of storage. Big enough for a big table and chairs in the middle there. The window to the front and then the glazed double doors to the back that you saw a minute ago, giving you access onto the seating area. Back through into the dining room. And then down into a large lounge. So the lounge has got a wood burner as well. Massive space. There's a bench built across the back there with shelving above. window and a door to the front there. And glazed double doors again opening into the back. You've then got a hobby room, a quite full hobby room, but a hobby room nonetheless. With plenty of activities on the go, so ideal for somebody who needs a study space or for a hobby room. Back into the living room. A bar there in the corner. Back through into the dining room. And upstairs. So just off the landing here you've got the master bedroom. Left hand door there is a walk-in wardrobe. Right hand door is an ensuite shower room bathroom which I'll show you in a minute. Got a glazed door opening onto a balcony at the back overlooking the fields that come with the property. So there's just under six acres, or around six acres, I should say. Really good sized room. So a large shower, venti in it. Heated towel rail, toilet and bath, and jacuzzi bath. And an extractor fan. A 
back out onto the landing where the curtains are at the end that goes through to the apartment which I'll show you in a minute. This is the second bedroom in the main house. It's got its own ensuite as well, so an ensuite shower room in this one with an extractor fan and heated towel rail. Back out onto the landing. So previously you just carried on to more bedrooms through this door. But now it is a self-contained apartment with independent access. A couple of steps down, you've got a storage cupboard there on the right hand side. A seating area there. Good size bedroom. Next to that, you've got the bathroom. It's a bath's got a shower over it, toilet and hand basin. So a little study area tucked away there. And then into the living room. So this, of course, could be converted back into another bedroom. But is now part of this one bedroom self-contained apartment. A good living space. And fitted kitchen. A utility area here and this was the shower room before when it was a bedroom this was the shower room out then onto the balcony land goes to the trees you can look down into the garden main garden area there balcony that you see there comes out from the master bedroom and round to look at the land again. This is due to be cut very soon. One field shelter there. And this is just to show you the access to it. So you've got its own access. Another look around the kitchen. And back out onto the landing. This is the sheet. So this is a detached sheet. And the access there goes to the land. To the side, well, behind the sheet and behind the house. So straight in. And you've got an open plan living and kitchen area. Would have been an old bread oven. You can just see the archway there that's uh, got stoned in. But that would have been the bread oven. Got a wood burner for your heating. Door out to the rear. And this is all going to be cut soon. You see the field shelter and the limit by the big trees at the back. So this is used by a family member, member, it's not let out at the moment. Kitchen units. Space there for a freestanding cooker with an extractor hood over, under counter fridge. 
and through here you have a utility area with your washing machine and your electrics. So upstairs now and on the first floor landing Good size landing. So a second bedroom. Main bedroom. Double aspect. and then the shower room. If you'd like any more details about this property, please head across the website suzanneinfrance.com. Thank you.